God, this is a bloody outrage. You're positive that you heard them right. Hi, Captain. The stowaway you found might not be as trustworthy as you may think. <sighs> You're absolutely sure. Aye, Captain. Then... Then the stowaway, I'll have to go and speak with them. Better yet, go and fetch them for me. Aye, aye, Captain. Ah. <sighs> Can't even trust my own first mate. Mm. Ah, good. You're here. So, I'm guessing you're probably wondering why my first mate has brought you in here. Apparently, word of mutiny has spread amongst the crew. That you are not exactly being honest with me, now aren't you? No, you're not. Remember, I can tell when people are lying. My ear is twitching. You've been lying to me this whole time. I will admit, I must have let my feelings of attractiveness towards you blind me. But now that I hear this mutiny, I must say, I can see things clearly now. Now tell me the truth. Who are you? Why are you here? And why is it, specifically, you want Sparrow? So you're sticking with your story from the other day? Fine, then. <clears throat> no, I do not know what I will do with you. But know this. I will keep trusting you, if you are who you say you are. But, if I so much as hear one more word of mutiny from my crew members, then ye be saying hello to Davy Jones's locker for me. Would you do that? Glad we could come to an understanding. And if I remember right, one of the scouters said that they had spotted land, but a day's trip away. By the time we get to land tomorrow morning, I will see what I will do with you. In the meantime, remember, you are on my ship until we reach land. And once we do, then you are free to do as you wish. For an hour. Why an hour? Simple. If I let you go for a whole day... Then it is possible you might escape me, if I hear you are lying to me. Or, perhaps, I might think of another more painful way to dispose of you. You're not lying. <laughs> Still, why don't I believe it? What are you doing? No, stay! <clears throat> How dare you kiss me? What in bloody hell were you thinking? Was it good? I... No, it, it was not good. It was sudden. You want me to... You want me to kiss you now? Oh, you think I can do better? <laughs> I'm not falling for your lies. <clears throat> Disgusting. Why must you keep trying to kiss me? In fact, why are you kissing me? You find me attractive. <sighs> why? Why must everyone want to kiss me? Is it just because I am a woman, or is it there's something more? <clears throat> I wasn't saying anything. <sighs> now listen, I want you to do something right before you leave for tomorrow morning. 
I want you to swab this whole ship. Spotless. I don't want to see a single drop of blood, sweat, or even any other type of filth that you or the rest of the crew will produce. If you miss a spot, I will throw you off the ship and make sure to tie an anchor around your waist so that there is no possible way of you getting back up. Let go of my hips. You... What? You think I'm beautiful? Pirates aren't beautiful. Say you do to get my trust back. What is it exactly you plan to do in order to try and get my trust? <laughs> Bloody hell. Why? All right, I will continue trusting you. Once we get to shore, though. Other than that, oh. I'll... <sighs> I'll make sure that no more rumors of you being a traitor are in the midst of the crew. In the meantime, I suggest that you keep yourself in your in your quarters keep yourself in your cell it might prove beneficial for you i wouldn't want anyone to hurt you no i'm not blushing i'm just i'm just tired that's all just go now leave me be God damn it. Why are you attracted to this person? They're just a normal being, like the rest of your crew. Though, with the beef they have with Sparrow, and the one you have, could it be possible that... Ah, no way that that old fool is capable of understanding or even being the cause of this... Attractiveness. Ah, no, you stupid butt. Ah. Just remember that once you and the crew get to shore, that you have to find a way to deal with them. But the question is, how am I going to do it?